So I think we bring to the table, um, you know, that uh, refreshing mm -hmm. vision, um, you know, that reset, uh, because we have our view mm -hmm. of what the party should be, not necessarily um, tainted by decades or, or a long time uh, in a position and entrenched in any particular way. Mm -hmm. I think uh, there is a flexibility when you have a, a new uh, set of prisms looking and examining the institution and how to take it forward. We saw. Uh, I, I, I want yeah, yeah, ro any role for Patrick Faber, um, Anand Patrick Faber, in, in, in your vision? Certainly, there, there is um, there is a role for all of the the past leaders. Uh, John Saldiva is a, is a former leader as well. He's a former party leader, and so I will have both of them uh, in the central executive, as the constitution of the United Democratic Party stipulates that mm. all former party leaders should be a part of the central executive, which is a, a significant body. Obviously, the National mm. Convention and the MPC are the two superior bodies of the party, but certainly the central executive plays a role. And I would like uh, the all three uh, living uh, former party leaders to play a role uh, in moving the party forward. That is Prime Minister Barrow, Minister former Barrow. party leader uh, uh, Farber, and former party leader John Saldiva.